My mother, her mother had died, and as a result, she had some money. She decided that they were going to have a new house, so she got Harry Batten, who was the head of NWA at the time, who could be a real sneak, and he, um, uh, and he took her around and showed her all these places that he thought would be good. And there were two houses on Washington Square, which were really just beautiful houses. And she was very excited about it, and she was, had, was getting an architect and all that. And she got a, a notice from the city uh, one morning after Dad had left that the houses were condemned. So she waited until he'd gotten home and he'd gotten in bed and she'd gotten him his dinner and she then attacked him head on, waving this paper in his face. And, um, and he, of course, being very smart, looked quite terrified and said that he would have whoever it was call her up as soon as humanly possible to discuss this. She said to me, I'm so upset because they say the houses really are, are dangerous and I really have to either tear them down or take them apart and then put them back together again. And I really can't afford to do that. They were huge houses. So she tore them down and she hired a man called Brumball, who was, we won't go into Mr. Brumball, but anyway, he, um, he designed a, what they call now a neo-colonial house for them.